So uh, this is my review of the Zoe Celestrius keyboard. So it's made by Zoe, as you can see. Uh, sorry for the autofocus. Well, this is the keyboard, as you can see. And like uh, everyone is saying, the keys fade. And uh, I might have to take a picture of it to show you how it's faded. It, it doesn't look faded um, by video, but when I take a picture of it, you you see what I mean. And I'll post it up with this video. And so what what you get inside the box? Uh, pretty much is pretty empty, pretty bare, nothing. When you get stickers, I didn't even get a manual. So, and you get a PS uh, PS slash two uh, adapter, which I'm already using. I plugged it into my computer, and you can see it's plugged into the back of my computer. So uh, last time I told you that uh, I'll give you a picture and this is the picture uh, where the keys are fading. And as you can see uh, ASD and QW are faded more than the other keys that are still bright. Uh, I'm, what I can say is uh, it's kind of worse quality than the other keyboard manufacturers is only kind of fall short on this one so uh, what kind of feature it has well let's see it has the 1x to 8x uh, repeater speed the delay speed or whatever response time speed whatever you call it and you can change it by pressing this button and any of 1 to 8x so 1x, 2x, 4x and 8x and as you can see uh, the light goes with whatever button you press and uh, what else? Oh, and the Zoe logo color uh, changed, but it kind of sucked because there's only two colors that you can change to. Which most key keyboards you could uh, you could actually change to multiple colors: red, blue, uh, purple, whatever color you want. Like Ra Razor, Razor keyboards does that. So. Uh, to change the color, all you have to do is press this button and the Windows key. And you can see that it changed to uh, red. Well, let me turn off the light so you can actually see the color. And you can see it's red. And when you change it back, change it back to blue. It's kind of, yeah, bland. I mean, I, I think this is the worst keyboard I ever bought. Yeah. And plus, uh, I even uh, miss those media keys that I had on my old keyboard. I'll show you uh, later on. So uh, this is my old keyboard. Pretty nice, right? It's made by Rose Will. It's kind of dirty. Actually, it's pretty dirty. 
And what I like about this keyboard is um, it has these media keys. See? Uh, home key, it directly uh, shortcuts to uh, Internet Explorer or some, you know, Firefox. Search, uh, search your folder, favorite, it opens up your favorite, and uh, what, Internet Explorer? And email, you know what email does. It opens up your email, your Outlook, whatever the fuck. I mean, I'm sorry. Uh, and um, what's best about this keyboard is uh, it has a power button, which uh, you, all you do is just press it and usually it just goes straight to shutdown. And my new keyboard doesn't have that. It doesn't have a lot of keys that I don't have on my old keyboard that I like. Which I kind of miss. Which uh, I feel uh, that this keyboard sucks.